Okay, let's talk about a super cool AI image generator called Flux AI that gives Midjourney some serious competition. It can create high quality realistic images, even handle text inside pictures really well. The best part, it's completely free and open source. In this video, I'll show you three easy ways to use this awesome AI tool. So let's dive in. So Flux AI is from Black Forest Labs and this is their website. If you come down, you can see these are some of the images that create with this AI. You can see that Flux AI is really good with text creations like this lengthy text image. Another speciality is its realism like this image of old man. You can see how good and real this image looks. As you can see, all the images are look super good and different styles like animation, portrait, photorealism and even with text. And if you come down further, you can find three different variants of Flux AI. The first one is Flux Pro model. Next, you can see Flux Dev model. And finally, you can see the Flux Channel. So these are the three different variants of Flux AI. And let's see some ways to access this AI for free. First method to access Flux AI is from their hugging phase. In the hugging phase, you can find Black Forest Labs to access this tool. Don't worry, I'll leave this hugging phase URL in description below. Here you can see we have Flux Channel and Flux Dev models. So you can try both of these models. For this video, I'm gonna try this channel model. As you can see, this is a very simple interface. First we have prompt area. Then we have advanced settings option. Here we can enter our seed number. Next, we can adjust the aspect ratio of the image. Finally, we can control the number of steps to generate the image. Okay, now let's create an image from this model. For my image prompt, I'm gonna enter beautiful blonde girl wearing fancy black dress in a party and click run. Wow, this image looks super good and real. Our character is holding a champagne glass on her hand and all the fingers are look super good. And the image is very accurate to my prompt. Now let's try another one with text. For this image, I'm simply gonna enter dog holding a side, say bark and click run. Here you can see our dog with the bark side. It's not actually hold inside, but considering the simple prompt I enter, this looks super good. For the next tool we are going to use is CART AI. So CART is a free online AI image generator. In here, you can find lots of different AI image generation models to create images. Click this flux text to image option to access. And you will come to this page. First, you can find the image prompt area to enter text. Then image aspect ratio. And finally, the seed number. Let's create an image. For the image prompt, I'm going to enter beautiful 21 years old girl wearing glasses and office dress in office. For the image size, I'm going to select 16 by 9. And finally, click generate to begin. This is the final image. Wow, this image looks amazing and both of the image characters are looks realistic and have tons of details. Let's try another one. For this image, I'm entering Beautiful 25 years old girl wearing white t-shirt in a street of New York. Look at the final image. Our image character is realistic and you can see the blurred American flag and the New York yellow taxi in her background. So we can imagine this is from New York. Okay, both of the images we generated look super good. Now let's try another one with text. For that, I'm gonna enter line holding a board that says I love pizza. So this image is kinda cartoon animation but the text we entered looks accurate and line is holding the sign correctly. Now let's try the third method and it's going to be glyph.app and this is the glyph AI website. You can find the site link in description below. To get started, click build. Then click this plus icon here. Here you can see it have text input models, image input models and multi-bake models. From here, select image generation option and you will come to this interface. First, we have image prompt section to enter our prompt. In image generation models, we have Stable Diffusion Excel, DALI Tree, Controlism, Flux Pro, Flux Dev, and Flux Channel. So in here, we can use Flux Best Model, which is Flux Pro, for free. Next, select an image size. I'm gonna select Landscape. Next, click Advanced Controls. Here we can control the number of steps and prompt power option. Okay, now let's create our image. Come to the prompt area, and enter your image prompt. I'm gonna enter beautiful African tribe woman and click run this glyph button on the right side. This is the output image. 
This looks amazing and the image character looks ultra realistic. This image is highly detailed and very high quality. I think Splash Pro model is the best among their models. So let's try another one. For this time, I'm gonna simply enter portrait of a Spartan warrior and click run this clip. Just look at that. Details, lighting and realism is on another level. I think this model is the best so far I tried in this video. Now let's create a text image with this model. So I'm gonna enter, they are holding a sign that says, I love honey and click run this cliff. This is the final image and you can see a illustration version of a bear holding the sign that says, I love honey and the text and the image looks super good and very creative. For free and open source tool, I think Flux AI is one of the best AI image generator in the market and if you are someone who looking to create mid journey or higher quality images, Flux AI is the best tool you can use for free. So try Flux AI, I will leave the side links in the video description for you to use this amazing AI. If you found this video helpful, give me a thumbs up and subscribe to my channel for more AI tools like this and I will see you in the next video.